What's up, y'all? JoJo here. Make sure you like, subscribe, share your boy content. If you're new to this channel, check out my other videos to catch up on my vibe. So, um, I want to show you guys today's video. I'm showing you guys how to post a picture within a picture using iMovie. Some of you guys might not be um, familiar with, you know, iMovie or any other auto editing softwares, but today's video, like I said, I'm gonna show you guys how to, uh, you know, post a picture with inside of a picture, and this will help you. Um, this basically will help you when it comes to like reaction videos and stuff like that. So without further, without further ado, let's get to the video. Message. All right. So we have my screen on the screen. We have my screen display, right? So what we're gonna do is. <clears throat> This is what we're going to do. We're going to go to iMovie, right? Because since I haven't dropped a video in like a week, people be like, man, where you at, Joe? Where you at? Yeah, yeah, your profile say you're dropping um, weekly videos. But hey, man, things been going on. Not only have I been feeling, I wouldn't call, I wouldn't say I've been feeling fatigued, but, um, but um, you know, things happen. All right, so for this example, we're going to just delete this. All right, so let's say if I have iMovie open, right? If you haven't followed my, I had did a, I did a reaction. I had, um, how can I put it? I made a reaction video, how to do it on your phone. So if you didn't have a laptop or, or a desktop, you know, I made a video for that so you can do it on your phone so it can be that so basically it's that easy all right so let's do it all right so first thing we're gonna do we're gonna go to iMovie right and let's say uh, let's find a video I'm gonna go to my recents let's find a video um it's something I kind of did earlier right so once you have your video set up you want to be very okay. Let's let me upload my other. Let me upload one of my other videos too. All right, I'm gonna upload this random video right here. Boom. Okay. So I hit Control. I hit Command Plus to expand the timeline because I'm using a different mouse. So right now I'm using. I wish I could show y'all. I don't know if y'all can see it. I'm using this type of mouse right here, right? So there's nothing. I can't pull the cord without it making a mess. It ain't the normal mouse that I'm typically I typically use, but I'm gonna use it for now. Fuck it. All right. So typically, um, um, yeah, like I said, to expand the timeline, just hit minus command plus or command um minus. All right. So what you want to do is figure out what video you want on top and figure out what video you want on bottom, right? And for some odd reason, we have recorded audio. All right. So once you decide what video you want on top, what video you want on bottom, it should be self-explanatory. So let's say, once you, once you have your photos and your videos, video set up, right? What you want to do is go, and go to the top. It, has you, it gives you options. It gives you, you know, this square tool. It gives you this, you know, color tool. You know, color tool. Go your crop tool, your audio, audio, and stuff like that, right? You know, you can slow it down. You work with the speed. You can add filters and stuff like that. So... In today's video, what you want to do is whatever audio or whatever video or photo of your of your choice, you want to click that uh click that right. You're gonna go over here to the um the squares, and then you're gonna click cutaway right, and then it has, it gives you the options. So you can either put them side to side, which is kind of cool. But in this example, in this video, we're going to put a picture within a picture. 
And I'm going to let you know right now, the reason why I like iMovie when it comes to uh, making reaction videos, because it's, it, 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 it's so easy. It's so easy. Where on Final Cut Pro, which I'm going to do a tutorial on, and also Premiere Pro, it can be a, it can just be difficult where it just, it's just not what I want. So let's say, um, so another reason why I will make a, I will be making a reaction video on Premiere is because of sometimes the audio, when you try to, um, synchronize the audio on iMovie or Final Cut Pro for some odd reason it be getting out of sync once you get to the end of the audio which is frustrating so if you continue if you're still watching this video what we're gonna do next is we're gonna go to um, uh, we're gonna click on the picture that we just we're gonna click on the video that we chose to you know put aside of the picture right so besides that it gives you more options right so you can add, yeah. it gives you more options. So you want to add a border, you can, like I would. I typically will add a border, right? And then you get the option of changing the color of your choice. I don't typically like my border that big, so I'm going to go with the basic. And then not only that, it gives you a drop shadow option, right? So what that drop shadow does is gives it that little... Um, it gives it that little pop. It gives it the little effect that it's like it's like 3D in a way. If it does, if it does, it don't. But so. and that's pretty much it when it comes to uh, that's pretty much it when it comes to the audio. Uh, see, that's pretty much it. And that's the reason why I like doing it on iMovie because it's so simple. As it, it's as if. If it's, it's as if that's what iMovie is really used for, <laughs> you know, but uh, um, what else, what else, what else? So what I was saying earlier was whenever your music comes, when it comes to be out of sync with iMovie, it becomes an issue. So let's say if you're recording your uh, reacting to your video, right? For some odd reason, it just, it just out of sync and that's the issue. I haven't, I haven't, um, I haven't figured out the remedy. When it comes to that so you know until then guys hopefully you know if you have any questions if you can comment below actually what you might think that possibly might be do that if not um, I'm gonna figure out a remedy eventually and then I'm gonna let you guys know so look I think that's pretty much it if you enjoyed the video Jojo we out